Brad Respawn coming at you with another video. Boom. I'm Brad Respawn. I've got a quick video here regarding the new Doom game. In the background, uh, you can see the uh, original Doom, Need Deep in the Dead playing. Uh, probably one of the best video games ever made, in my opinion. Uh, revolutionized the gaming industry as we know it, and just uh, the, the way we play video games. You could say it created a whole genre of video games as well. Uh, just with its non-stop, ridiculous, over-the-top, gory action based on a lot of uh, the movies of the day. Uh, in software, you know, legendary. Those guys were rock stars after they released this. But we're not really here to talk about that. I could, I could talk about it all day, really, but I'm not going to. Instead, we're going to take a look at the Doom 2016 Collector's Edition, which, in my opinion, is pretty cool. So, here we have the box which it came in. Uh, the sweet Doom logo with the Revenant in the background there. UAC logos on the side. Standard back panel with uh, info on what's in the game. You know, a little blurb, you know. Oh, it's time to fight like hell. All that kind of stuff. But this guy just slips off right here and reveals uh, the main box below. Uh, some really sweet Revenant artwork. Can't go wrong there. It looks great. Nice and glossy. Again on the sides, the UAC logo. And uh, yeah, let's crack this guy open real quick. Um, when you open it, you'll notice it on the top flaps here before I really get into it. Yeah, here, let me let me bring this down here. Yeah, quick warning in regards to uh, being careful when you remove the model from the packaging, along with instructions on how to put in a couple batteries, as it does have some LED lighting in it. Uh, here we have the game, and it's a, a steel case. Very nice inside the game, you know, some leaflets and all that kind of stuff. Really, really nice looking case. And now we have the... Uh, the model encased in its foam prison, if you will. Here you go. Uh, looks pretty cool with the Doom logo on the front, I gotta say. Kinda neat, kinda neat. Uh, but yeah, here, let me get this, uh, let me get this open here real quick. So once I take the top off, you'll notice that it is in a plastic bag for its protection. Comes off, uh, pretty easily there and then this guy just pops out and we'll get him out of his bag in just two seconds. As you can see it's a really nice looking model. Uh, it's based off of the uh, 3D model from the game. It looks absolutely amazing. Uh, he is secured to the base and it is quite heavy which is rather nice. It looks great. And, you know, It'd be a great piece on anybody's mantle or anything like that. And right now we get a quick look at the LED lights. Looks pretty sweet.